I'm in the streets. Shit. I don't feel like uh, the truth got to be a color. And the truth also don't got nothing to do with popularity. So the popular fucking idea is that Vlad is the police. Vlad gets niggas arrested. Shout out to my nigga uh, Ant. Urban politicians and shit like that. Um, he always clarifies in all his videos that, you know what I'm saying, it's not that. But for niggas to come with that ignorant guy, I got that, that ignorant chicken George ass bullshit talking about Vlad is the fucking police. And, and it bothers me because it, to me, it's along the same fucking lines of a bitch uh, claiming that, um, uh, her father wasn't there, and that's why she strips. Um, a bitch claiming, ah, uh, I didn't, uh, Suki Hana, ah, uh, I didn't know the music business was like this, so I signed a contract, and now I don't got no money. No, bitch. You signed a contract because you were broke. You signed a contract, you got the fucking money, and now that you have to work, now it's, ah, you don't know what the fuck is going on. And we're supposed to uphold Whatever the fuck you say because you're a woman, it's the damsel in distress whole bullshit. Uh, you see the, the lady on side of the road, there's smoke coming from the hood, um, and uh, she has a white dress on, the white lipstick and shit, the, the red lipstick and shit, and uh, you're supposed to just go over there and help her because it's, it's a woman, but then you go over there to help her, and niggas hit you over the head with a fucking, you know what I'm saying, pipe and kill you and take your fucking car and shit like that because they know that it's the damsel in distress shit because she's a, a woman you're gonna go over there and try to help at the end of the fucking day you didn't put gas in your car you're on side and of course you'll stop you'll stop and try to help a lady on side of the road but I, that's just what i'm talking about the fact of the matter is if you go on vlad and you're still committing crimes because you went on Vlad, that does not mean that you have a pass to commit co co to continue uh, doing crimes. Plus the fucking fact, if if you still doing crimes, why in the fuck are you on Vlad talking about doing crimes? Like what the fuck? Like how? And then oh man, I got arrested with Vlad fault. What the fuck, nigga? You still in the street? You still in the street, so anything can happen. You don't get to go on Vlad, and then because I went on Vlad, I better not get arrested. It's his fault. What the fuck? ARM has already came out and said it didn't have shit to do with Vlad. Every nigga that got bam said that man that shit ain't have shit to do with no fucking Vlad. Oh man, of course now somebody's fucking calling. Fuck. Yeah, but um, uh, yeah, all right. Dog, you did that shit. Like, if you go on Vlad and you still committing crimes, then why would you go on Vlad and talk about doing crimes? You should be talking about, even though, even though Vlad is going to ask you about what you talk about in your music. Now, if in your music, if in your music, all you talk about is trap, 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 trap. And you come on Vlad, or if you don't talk about trap, 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 and you just got arrested, you know that Vlad is going to ask you criminal questions. So let's go. Let's we can go off the premise that Vlad is the police. So everybody know that Vlad is the police. So Sue Surf just got locked up. Sue Surf just got locked up. All right. So because Sue Surf just got locked up, oh, let's 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 go check. Let's go check and see if uh, Surf got a Vlad interview. Oh, he sure do got a Vlad interview. Vlad, the reason why he got locked up. But if we go off that premise, then Surf had a lot of fucking interviews. As did ARL, as did any artist, as did Robo, as did any artist that been on Vlad. They've been on a lot of fucking platforms. How the fuck do you know it's Vlad? Because Vlad asked street questions that niggas is too scared to ask. Me and Urban Politician was talking about that shit. We said, we said, if a nigga asked the question that Vlad asked. Yeah. Thank you. This this is giving out money in here. Yeah, I'm not 
No, actually, I found that on, on the a, floor in here, so yeah. I'm going to give it to you. Okay. Instead of taking it myself, I'll pass it forward. Okay. That's it. You guys need it? You guys need a dollar? Okay. 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 All right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I'll pass it forward. We'll do it. That's well, good. Thing. Thank you so much. All right. That might have been a little bit racist, but all good. But here the thing is, if you don't get to go, and, and see that my whole issue with all this shit is, um, is first let's get down to that point. Nigga was saying that if me and Urban Bob Sister said if we did a show, if we uh did an interview with somebody and we asked the questions. That Vlad be asking niggas, niggas would get up and leave the interview, niggas would threaten to fight us, all kind of shit. And then what Vlad will do, after you say you don't want to talk about it, he'll then ask you the same question a different way. Yes, he will do that, but we all know that shit when we go on Vlad. Benny the Butcher was just up there. What did Benny the Butcher do? He did the same thing that uh, Pee Wee Longway did. What did Yellow Beezy do? He did the same thing that Pee Wee Longway did. He said, no, nah, I ain't no crip, I ain't no nothing. That's the fuck. He don't control what the fuck you say. Sir went to the fucking interview saying that you get people indicted. So you think that the fuck Sir said something in that interview that can get him indicted? Are you fucking serious? He came in the interview the same way Benny the Butcher did, the same way Yellow Beezy did. They came with they came on the show with the understanding and with the knowledge that niggas believe that Vlad is somewhere in some way connected with the fucking police. So I'm not going to incriminate myself on this show, but I'll be motherfucked. I'll be motherfucked. You know, sir, he always does uh, interviews with 15 minutes of fame. Hip hop is real, but none of that shit matters because we're going to pick the white man. It's the white man that did it. And my issue with that is there is zero accountability and you cannot grow from that. You can't grow from saying that it's somebody else's fault. But when you start looking introspectively, looking at yourself and fixing those problems inside of you, that's when the progression comes. That's when the elevation comes. That's when the evolution comes. When you can look at yourself and say, that was my fault. I have an issue with doing that. So what was the real problem? The real fucking problem was because there's been niggas that came on Vlad that were way more gangster than fucking Sue Surf. But they've not yet been a fucking arrested. That's because they don't do shit to get fucking arrested. Sue Surf got hit for weed. And what was I think what 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 it did didn't uh didn't Surf get hit for weed in a gun? What did Surf get hit for? When the weed in the gun? Y'all niggas don't act like y'all don't know what the fuck going on. This shit ain't nothing like the YouTube. Nigga would have been said, goddamn. And YouTube motherfucker would have been said what the fuck it was. Yeah, these niggas. But, yeah, these niggas, they ain't on shit. What did Surf get arrested for, y'all? Or maybe I don't know who Surf is. Yeah, these niggas, I don't know, man. Y'all gotta step y'all shit up. But, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, Surf got hit for weed, okay, yes, weed and a gun. And maybe my shit is late. That's probably what it is. My shit late than a motherfucker. Because I'm going through this fucking, uh, this badass area right now. So, And then look at this fucking idiot. This nigga says, damn, Midwest Muno Moon Official. You blocked, my nigga. As soon as I get off this bitch, you block. Yeah, you block. I wish I can block your motherfucking ass now. I can't block you now. Yep, your ass is blocked. You come with this fucking faggot shit. Nigga, I'm not with that shit. It was, a, it was, oh, you're right, you're right. It was ammunition. It was ammunition. It was ammunition. It was ammunition. Here's the thing. That's a bullshit-ass charge. That is a bullshit fucking charge. But just like with Meek, 
just like with me, you know that the fucking folks is after you. Surf is is like you understand that the police is after you. It seems like you're a hot spot for fucking like nigga. Like you've been talking about uh, uh, if you want to talk to the inmate, press nine. Nigga, you've been saying that shit since you know what I'm saying. You battle fucking like uh hitman. Nigga, you been talking about jail shit. So you know what the fuck this shit is. And you still ain't goddamn got your shit together? The fuck are you doing with bullets? Were you gonna throw them at somebody? Or or maybe, you know, they just found the bullets and they and they and, and surf was doing the right thing and had the, the, the find the uh uh compartment or some shit like that. Or maybe, you know, they didn't find but a little bit of weed and maybe he didn't know there was a bullet in the car. You know, it was it was in the back seat. Or maybe they planted the shit on him. You know what I'm saying? These are all the fucking real things that's going on. We may have corruption in the police department. Uh, Surf may have a fucking drug problem. Surf may be skits because, you know, niggas tried to kill him and now his mind is running a different kind of way. There are so many things that can actually be the problem. But going over here and saying, man, Vlad, then got another nigga locked up, man. Are you fucking serious? That shit bothers me, dawg. It bothers me.